My name is Jewel Gonzalez. I'm a senior at Phillipsburg High School, and I'm on a mission. When I walk out on the mat and you know you look up and you see all those eyes on you, it just it fills it fills my heart with a bunch of pride. And to know that you know girls and women uh, back in the day didn't have this opportunity, you know it just it makes me really proud to be in the time that we are. You know the first year coming here, it was pretty nerve wracking, never seeing a crowd this big. I mean we get a lot of people coming to our dual meets, but you know this is just this is a whole nother level. And um, this year coming in, I'm definitely more comfortable. Um, I see some familiar faces. I have friends from Team New Jersey that are back again, coming to you know, reclaim their second state title. I'm excited for them. I'm excited for all the young girls watching. Um, as I approach bout time, it's, it's more about just you know, taking this time to sit back and realize that this is it. Um, I listen to music, it, um, it helps me uh, at the same time while it's pumping me up, it, it kind of cools me down at the same time. My coaches are going to run me through a quick warm up, uh, they're going to get my heart rate elevated and uh, I'm going to get, uh, you know, you want to knock the, bad, the first uh, set of bad wind out of my lungs uh, and get me going, get a good sweat in. Stay champ on three. One, two, three! Stay champ. The bout itself, I just, you know, I set up my game plan and, you know, what I plan to do and how I want to execute things and um, that's about it, you know, it's not so much getting nervous, you know, everyone gets nerves, I'd, I'd, I'd be lying to you if I said I wasn't, you know, a little bit, you know, I get a little bit of butterflies because, you know, that's just unrealistic, um, but I'm definitely confident in my abilities to go out and get things done on the mat. Same as last year, uh, I figured I had a lot of uh, momentum going into this tournament, a lot of confidence, and and honestly, I just try and go out there and you know show everyone what I got. You know, I put a lot of time in in the room with my coaches, with my teammates. I mean, I have the best workout partners in the entire state, and you know the best town behind me. And I just want to go get it done, and finish off my senior year very strong. Uh, one down and one to go, um, and you know I plan on getting a nice good night's rest tonight, get up early in the morning, get a nice workout in, and just prepare for that last match, that last hurrah. This is it. Now this is what we've all been working for. Um, for me, this will be my last uh, time stepping on the mat as a high school uh, wrestling athlete. Um, I'm just, I just plan to leave it all out on the mat. That's it. As long as I can execute everything and stay in good position, I should be, I'm, I'm confident. I guess I would just say I, I would I would describe it as um, uh, fulfilling almost. You know, I feel like I really made my mark on my school. I made my mark in the state of New Jersey, and it's all I can ask for. And all I can ask for is that girls look at me and say, you know, be better. Than, you know, I want them to be better than me. I'm I'm just the start. These these upcoming girls, they're so they're gonna be something to watch. Starting uh, in 2012 when Brandon Hall uh, won the last state championship title before mine last year, uh, he made a new tradition that, you know, the upcoming state champs, you win a state title, you got to dip in that ocean. And, you know, that would mean a lot to me, especially since his father passed. I'm very close with the family. Uh, Coach Hall was very near and dear in my heart. And uh, I got this tattoo for him. Uh, so I'm, uh, I'm ready to uh, dip in the ocean.
she's a fighter. She's humble and it's there's no words. No words. <laughs> you know, our fans come to matches and they want to they want to see people compete. They want to see them wrestle hard. Um, you know, it's been ingrained in our town for so long that you know, you want to make sure that you know, you put out a good product and Jewel certainly has. She's represented our town really well. I feel like I'm on cloud nine. It's really just been a high. <laughs>